Batch day is today. It's the day when medical students across the country find out at the same time where they'll be spending their next three to seven years of residency. Hundreds of medical students across Houston are participating in match day. They come from a total of five total medical schools across our area. This graduating class of doctors began training in 2021 masked up, of course. With that, let's go out to UT Health McGovern Medical School in the Texas Medical Center, where Dylan Humple joins us to talk more about his excitement for match day. First, congratulations, Dylan. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thanks for having me. And thank you for being with us. Uh, talk to us. I, I'm, I'm interested to know what inspired you to go into medicine. Oh man, it's a little bit of a long story. Uh, you know, my dad's a physical therapist, so I was kind of like my medical connection. Um, however, you know, I kind of had a big life event happen to me when I was 13 years old. Um, my family was in a plane crash, um, and you know, we're all very injured. My mom ended up passing away in the plane crash, and um, you know, I had compression fractures in my spine. My, my younger sister, you know, she barely survived. She had internal organ damage and a fractured spinal vertebrae, and all these injuries. She was in the ICU for, you know, almost two weeks. And, um, you know, going through that experience with my family and, and seeing her come out of it and, and seeing um, just how much good doctors can do yeah. uh, in their patients' lives um, was really inspiring for me. And, um, you know, thought about how I could honor my, my mom in the process, too. So that's kind of a little bit of what brought me into medicine. Yeah, that's, a, that's an incredible story. Heartbreaking. But to see you turn that pain uh, into purpose, I know that's cliche to say. Uh, and, and, and use it as inspiration to drive you to go to uh, into medical into a medical field and help others is really incredible. Uh, have you decided on a specialty? Um, I applied orthopedic surgery and I and I got the the match email on Monday, so I'll know I'll be an orthopedic surgeon. Congratulations, congratulations! Uh, I know we are what less than 90 minutes away. Um, talk to us about what's running through your mind, where you're at, uh, all the emotions. Yeah, I mean, I think, you know, mostly excited, a little nervous, mostly excited, but it's a good day. It's a beautiful day. It's something, you know, this day is something we've, me and all my classmates and all our families have been looking forward to for a long time uh, to find out where we're going to be, where we're going to be training. And so just a lot of gratitude, I would say, um, in my heart right now, and just really thankful to be here with uh, all my friends and family. Mm -hmm. For people not familiar with the process of Match Day, uh, talk to us about what goes into it, what you put forth, and, and obviously the outcome is going to be you're going to find out where you're going. But talk to us about the process. Give us a little insight on how this all came together. Yeah, so, you know, first years of medical school is just preclinical. You're doing lectures. Then your third year, you're in the ho third and fourth year, you're in the hospitals. And uh, it's in your fourth year whenever you apply about August. Um, and you apply to, you know, there's hundreds of programs you can apply to. And so you, you put out your applications. You get interviews December, January. Um, and then uh, beginning of March, you have to submit your rank list. And essentially, it's where you prefer to go. Uh, you submit your preferences and, and your rank list and uh, the programs you interviewed at, they'll also submit uh, their preferences on who they want as their future residents and then an algorithm just kind of magically matches us and so uh, and then um, on Monday of this week everyone got an email saying yes you match or no you didn't and then Friday we 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 find out where we match. Wow it really truly is an, it's an incredible experience I'm sure very nerve-wracking um, uh, we are so proud of you uh, tell us uh, long-term goals here looking into the future uh, where do you see yourself in, 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 in three years, obviously still in school and beyond graduation? Yeah, I see myself just hopefully, a, you know, a, a good, competent doctor who is very involved with community. Um, I myself, I'm from Corpus Christi, and so maybe ending up back home would be awesome in serving that community. That community has done so much for my family and I and uh, lots of people back home who I know are supporting me, and I thank them for that. And, um, yeah, that's just kind of where I see myself. Dylan Humple, uh, again, congratulations on everything you've accomplished so far. We, we are so proud of you, um, and I know you're going to go uh, even further with this. So uh, keep us posted. Let us know uh, what happens, and we will be cheering you on every step of the way. 
Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thanks for having me. Thank you, sir.